Thomas and Friends, episode 55, Oliver Sudrian Reunion. Oliver was pulling a train of ballast that he needed to be taken to Thomas's branch line. Oliver was already aware that Scruffy and Rickety were in his train, and he was right. Luckily, he had Toad to help him out in case they caused any trouble, but so far, no harm done. Oliver didn't know that Scruffy was planning vengeance against him because he pulled him apart years ago. And Scruffy now has the opportunity to pay him out. He whispered his plan to Ricky and the trucks. Soon they reached Gordon's Hill. As Oliver got to the top, they started to hold back. Hold back, said Scruffy, hold back. But Scruffy was didn't didn't know that it, Oliver had more strength than he did, and Oliver got the train up the hill. Oliver started to go down the other side. He wanted to go slowly. But Scruffy, Riggedy, and the trucks wanted him to go faster. On, 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 cried Scruffy, and the trucks pushed Oliver down the hill. Help, cried Oliver, as he raced down the track. Up ahead was the yards, and Oliver was heading straight for it. The points were set to go into the yard, and Oliver raced in. Something strange then happened when Oliver entered into the yard. The coupling between him and Scruffy broke and he went into a siding and the trucks continued on. The coupling between Toad and the trucks broke off too. Scruffy, Rickety, and the trucks broke through the back door of the work shed and went down another track straight towards a muddy pool. cried Scruffy. No, this is my perfect opportunity, and now I lost it. Henry came with the breakdown train. Soon the breakdown train got Scruffy onto a flatbed. Henry then said, Well, Scruffy, said Henry, Looks like a muddy pond deserves you right, it doesn't it? That would serve you right for getting vengeance on me, Scruffy, said Oliver. Well said, Mr. Oliver, said Toad. Scruffy just groaned as Henry took him away to the works.